So, you guys, I am picking up the big order for today. So, if you guys have ordered your items, please check out your email because you have ready to pick up email coming in. Make sure you guys let me know what time is good for you. Hey, guys, it's your girl Kay Cash Noel, and we're back at it again, better than before. Today is a very great, great, great day because my big package came in. It finally came in. I'm super excited. And as I mentioned to you guys before, I was going to take y'all on a journey how I pack my stuff and ship them away. I already have some of these shipping labels print out over here. This is my working station, as I told y'all before. This is my working station, so I do have some of these stuff already printed out. I don't want to show the information for everybody else, but this is my working station, and I have these labels printed. I'm repeating the same thing over and over again. As you guys know, when I start talking fast, I just blah, 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 blah. but it's because I'm so excited. But um, the things that are being shipped out are all here. And um, so we do have a lot of orders today. And I'm going to take you guys on a journey with me. Please bear with me because my laptop isn't working at the moment. So I cannot do the orders while um, while I'm on the phone. Like, because I record through my phone, as you guys know. So it's going to be a little hard for me. But we're going to make it work. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to snip it me putting stuff in here after I see because what I'm going to do first and I always tell y'all that first I always do my um when I pack up <sighs> breathing girlfriend okay it's just excitement right now so when I do pack my stuff up I normally do it through um I do my delivery orders first which means everybody's home base everybody who's local um, which will be anybody who's picking up because if you pick the pickup option you have to come pick up your items and your item will be here and if you don't pick up within a certain time frame i probably will refund it back to you and resell it to full price for somebody else so with that being said um my first thing first as i told y'all i got these little cute bags um i don't know if i ever showed y'all in these videos but i got these little cute little adorable bags from Dollar Tree and I just put my stuff inside of it my business card and these are from my because I used to put everything in the little envelope packets but when I got so much sales all my envelope packets went out and it went out fast and I was not expecting that that fast so it was overnight type stuff and um so now I just get these little cute ones that I could keep for hair delivery like local deliveries and pick up so that way we have these little cute things like this one says make made to shine this one says hello gorgeous another one says pure joy you know like those cute little turquoise color because it, it fits within my company colors so i of course i get the turquoise and it's so adorable and i just put them in and I put the wrapping paper on top and then i just give it to them that's it it's real simple so we're going to start off with my um Lord Jesus be my strength. We're gonna start off with the local stuff first, and then we're gonna show you how I'm gonna show you how I pack that. Then I'm gonna show you how I pack the um the other items. So I'm gonna get one local thing. For example, I'm gonna get one of the local persons, and I'm gonna pack their items, and I'm gonna record you do that. Record myself doing it in front of you. Okay. All right, TTYL. Well, not TTYL. Just hold on, cause I'm about to come back on. You don't even know I'm really about to come off, to be honest. I'm just telling you that. But we might just play my intro right about now. I'm on this lick in this weed just to balance. Remember people telling me I couldn't have this. They told me that I would never, ever be shit. Now my watch and my chain make them see sick. Yeah, it took a little minute, but it's worth the wait. Everything's starting to feel like a birthday. Niggas tried this shit on me in the worst way. But I kept that shit a hundred since the first day. I deserve it all. And I'm just gonna tell you from what I remember it is. So I do section these off. As you guys can see, they're all organized, but I section them off in a format where I can understand and it could be more organized when I'm shipping them. So what I do is I put my small, medium, then large in XL and two XL per color. So I know which direction I would need to go. So the first person, what she ordered was a, XL and a number one, which will be this one here. And this is the color, the number one set. So I'm gonna give her the 
it doesn't really matter how I pick it out. I just, just tell you what I'm gonna snatch from this bag. I'm just gonna pick up a bag and put it in here. She has more items as well. So I put her first one in the bag like this. And these are from my lo local customers. I do have more stuff that I gotta put in here. So just give me a sec. Is it XL to XL? 2 XL. So she got in 2 XL. Hopefully I got that right. Yeah, she said 2 XL. So the next 2 XL I have is right here. And then this is another 2 XL I got here. And these all goes to the same client. And I'll bag them as such. And then on top of that, what I normally like to do all I normally always do is I put my little thank you card in here, which is really nice. Vista print, I'll show you how to do this with my logo in here. And then I'll bag them my business card once I find it. So I got these little cute little bags like this. I placed my business card in this. I got this from this one girl who I brought products from. Her name is Exclusive. Find her on Instagram. I don't know if she still does company because she told me she was going to shut it down for a little bit. But yep, I did this like that. And then I put like a little goodie treat in the bag. Like depending on what I want to do or what I want to put in. So I put her a little Barbie clip because I got the Barbie clips in colors. And I put it right in here. Like so. And boom, her package is done. Sometimes I do put some of my Florence extension wraps in there as well. But um, this is not one of the instances I am doing that. So, and that's pretty much it. That's it. That's how you pack my little bags when it's going out to delivery, okay? Now here's the only tricky part of this. Because I have a lot of delivery packets, I have to remember which one is which. So I'm going to place with my handy dandy little pen in the inside so I don't get confused, their initials of the order. <laughs> and that way I know who this order is for, like so. All right, so that's how I pack up my little thing. And I actually put tissue paper on top, but I'm gonna show you guys the final look of how everything looks like because I want to get it to going. All righty? All right, bye. It looks so good in morning. So in this section, what I'm doing is pretty much showing you guys the packaging on how many packages I had to ship out. Also, I'm showing you guys the different city and states I am shipping out to. So I'm super excited. I'm glad for the growth. I'm glad for everything. I thank you guys all for your support. Thank you for always being amazing. And I guess, not guess, I want you guys to always grow with me as I grow. And that's what this channel is here for. So I'm going to show you guys how I ship out now. So I am at the postal office right now. I'm about to take these bags. And they're not, oh shoot, I don't got my damn phone on Hold on, y'all. Malfunction. But I'm going to take these two bags and ship them off to where it needs to be. They already have their labels on them. So I'm going to show you guys how I get this done. Okay? So give me one second. There is one right here. That's not as good as it normally is, but pretty much it's just me. And that's it, but I want to get these scanned in, so. Can I come in? Okay. Thank you. You're just getting a scan on them? Do they, they have their addresses on them? Yep, I just got to scan them in. Yeah, Pretty much when you scan the items in, they let you know like it's already prepaid. And then it shows you a zillow bounce as you scan it because you have to wait to make sure what you're scanning in is accurate to what you have in there as well. So you can see it says prepaid known. And you guys know I do everything through Rolo and Ship Station. So this is what we're doing here to make sure you guys get your orders on time the same day I receive it. And that's pretty much it. This at this moment, I'm just gonna make sure I'm gonna pee it up. Make sure I got it. 
I should have gotten something here and I don't, but this is fucking dumb. Normally they keep a key in here for me, but they want me to wait in line for my box. And it was like literally a small box. You want me to wait in line for it? All right, so I know y'all probably see me with this outfit on or you're gonna see me with this outfit on on my other video, but it's okay because I almost forgot to do the outro of my last, this video that you're watching right now. Yeah, that one. So I forgot to do the outro of that, but that's where I was pretty much showing you guys a typical day of me going out. And yeah, I know my hair was nice and red, but I had to take that out. I can't do wigs for too long. Not like that, but I like my wigs to take on and take off type stuff. And that's, it's that kind of vibe. That's not what we're talking about. Don't get a stack, okay? All right. So, like I was trying to tell y'all, um, yeah, the last video, the video we're watching right now, is pretty much telling in reference to um, how I pack my shipments, how I ship everything out, and how I go to the postal office and scan everything. And then it's already pre scanned and pre purchased. So, when I get in there, what I used to do was I used to just drop them off at the um package station they let you drop it off and that's it and just go right but i stopped doing that because what was happening was um i would drop it off on a thursday but my clients don't receive them until the next following week on a friday and i'm like what the fuck Juh? i'm not cursed as much as i told you guys that i'm like why but it was because um i guess because i was just scanning them in and then i dated whatever the hell they wanted to do you know you put it in there they would just do whatever the hell they want because i guess they figured the client has a tracker number, so we're gonna wait some more days. USPS, you gotta get that together. I'm just saying, <laughs> but um, yeah. So what I decided to do now to eliminate that from happening, because I pay for two day shipping. So or some of them are one day shipping, some of them are two day shipping, because they all total up to seven dollars. So whatever the seven dollars come up to, whether it's two days or one day, um, you should receive it soon. So I, instead, I wait in a line that I don't like to do. So I go on hours that I know there's not gonna be nobody there. And I just pretty much go in, scan all of them in, and I show you guys where he was scanning them in. And it'll just show you zero, 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 like zero dollars oh, owed because they've already been paid for. But I'll be just giving you more informational videos like that coming soon because, you know, I want to show you guys the background of everything I do when I ship anything out and also when I'm doing my sales. Um, if you guys haven't done it before, go watch my last video. Watch my last two videos. Just for fun, okay? Now, TTY, I gotta go, y'all. Bye! It's a girl, K Cash No L. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my platform, which is K underscore Cash underscore No L on IG, which is Instagram. And also follow me on Florence Extension on IG and on Facebook and Kennel's Closet, which is our fall clothing line and more clothing lines. Pretty much clothing line itself. And Kennel's Closet as well, which is going to be K E N O L S underscore closet on both facebook and ig all right well thank you so much for sitting here and watching this thing with me and tt motherfucking yl bye